Hi everyone, my name is Caroline Locklear and I'm a senior at Laney High School and I will be doing your devotion today. When things are going well for you, be glad. And when trouble comes, just remember, God sends both happiness and trouble. You never know which is going to happen next. Ecclesiastes 7.14 We are living through one of the strangest times and I think I speak for everyone when I say it's definitely not easy. We are stuck at home and feel as though our world is falling apart. Many things have been taken away from us, whether that be a sports season, a trip, a dance, a school year, or even a graduation. The future is uncertain and we are scared. All of this time alone has really allowed me to reflect on all of the blessings that I do have and how much I truly have to be thankful for. There are so many things in life that God has granted me that I take for granted without thought or thanks, like simply being able to go to school with my classmates or hang out with my friends. God has given us so much. Most of what we have, we take for granted. That is until it's lost and then becomes very important. Even though we can't physically be with one another, it is often in times like these where people are brought closest together. It isn't until we have things taken away that we truly can appreciate what they mean to us. God works in mysterious ways, and although it might not always be clear, he always has a plan. He never leaves our side, and he is there when things are going great and also in our times of trouble. I'm not necessarily saying that the coronavirus was God's doing. Instead, that during these trying times, he reminds us to stand strong in our faith. Being scared and worrying about what the future holds does no good. Instead, take this time to reflect on all of the blessings in your life and reach out to those who you love and those that have shown you God's love. Additionally, I hope that this time can allow you to develop a new appreci appreciation for the simple things joys in life that we often find ourselves forgetting. And now let us pray. Dear God, with all that's happening in the world due to the coronavirus spread, we feel anxious. We feel anxious for our health, our families, the community, and the world. Help us, Lord, to continue to trust you and to not be afraid. We know that you are here with us now and will be with us tomorrow and into the future. Please protect us in this worrisome time. Additionally, Lord, please empower and protect those who are working on the vaccination. Guide their work and connect. Guide their work to quick and good results. Please be with doctors and nurses who are on the front lines of our care. Give them energy for the task, compassion for patients, positive dynamics in their teamwork, and faith in you. Please help us to remember all of the blessings that you have given us. We ask these things in, in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, everyone. Have a good day.